friends welcome back to the channel if you're new here welcome my name is Arlise and I love baking treats and cooking up eats today I'll be making for you a peanut butter vanilla fudge and this is a no-bake recipe that it's easy to make at home so friends let's get started friends for your fudge we have here four simple ingredients. So I have my peanut butter and this is a smooth peanut butter. I'm going to be using a teaspoon of vanilla and I'm going to be using some vanilla frosting. And of course, I am going to be putting some peanut in my fudge, but I'll be grinding this in small pieces. First, I'm going to be crushing my peanuts. I think her peanut is crushed enough so in that case we'll say the fudge will have a little bit of crunch into it. First you're going to be emptying the whole jar of peanut butter into your mixing bowl. And then you're going to be making sure the cover from the frosting is off completely because you're going to be popping this in the microwave to heat up. And after I have melted this for 15 seconds and I'm now going to pour it into the peanut butter. And you're going to be mixing this to combine. I'm going to pop this back in the microwave for two more seconds. My friends, we're going to combine. Make sure everything is all incorporated. And this is where I am going to add my, uh, my peanut combo. Peanut is mixed in and I'm going to keep a bit of vanilla, about a half a teaspoon or a teaspoon of vanilla. I have my lime dish. I've lined it with some parchment paper. My friends, if you notice, I'll leave this on because it will be able to help me to lift it from the dish. So now I'm scooping it in the dish and you're going to be placing this in the fridge four hours. So we are going to set in the fridge. So friends, you're just going to smooth this out as smooth as possible or as smooth as you can get it. So 
now I'm going to cover and place in the fridge which is for two to four hours. Friends, clearly it's a new day. I did the video late last night and it was after one o'clock when the fudge was set. So here we are for the big reveal. Yay! Friends, so here is the fudge. Here is a fudge. And we're going to be cutting the fudge. So if you have a peanut allergy, the peanut in the fudge may not be a recipe for you, but you can do it without the peanut. You can store this in a tight lid container or I'm just going to be storing these in the same dish. Friends, so this is the end result of the peanut butter vanilla frosting fudge. If you made it this far in the video, thank you. Please leave your comments, share with your friends and family, give it a thumbs up if you like the video, subscribe, and don't forget to turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss the video. Love you all, God bless, and I'll see you in the next video.